A number of rule changes have been confirmed by the International Football Association Board IFAB, for the start of the next Premier League season, affecting both Manchester United and Manchester City. The most notable alteration has been made to the handball rule as goals scored are created by the use of an accidental handball will no longer stand. Instead, a free kick will be awarded to the opposing team if a goal or clear chance happens because of handball. It means goals like Willy Boley's goal against Man City earlier in the season will no longer stand. The same rule applies if a player regains possession or controls a ball by handling it, even if it isn't deliberate. David Eller, IFAB technical director, has explained the rule changes at their GM in Aberdeen this weekend. Deliberate handball remains an offense, he said. In the past we've managed to improve the laws by focusing on outcome rather than intent. What we are looking at particularly in attacking situations is where the player gets a clear unfair advantage by gaining possession or control of the ball, as a result of it making contact with their hand or arm, there has also been another change to the handball rule in that if the player's arms extend beyond a natural silhouette and it strikes their hand a foul will be given regardless if it was intentional or not. We've changed it to say the body has a certain silhouette, Ellery continued. If the arms are extended beyond that silhouette then the body is being made unnaturally bigger, with the purpose of it being a bigger barrier to the opponent or the ball. Players should be allowed to have their arms by their side because it's their natural silhouette. The IFAB have approved a number of other changes, too, in attempts to prevent time wasting and increase fairness in competition. Read more Man City news from next season. Substitutes will have to depart the pitch from the goal line or touch line they are closest to, instead of walking across the pitch to the technical area. Also, a dropped ball may be given in certain situations if the ball hits the referee, goalkeepers now only need